Eritrea is a country with a unique climate that is particularly sensitive to the effects of climate change. Droughts and floods have long been a challenge for the people of Eritrea, but in recent years, the impact of climate change has made these challenges even more severe. Extreme weather patterns, rising temperatures, changes in rainfall have all had a profound effect on Eritrea's water resources. Groundwater levels are declining, and water quality is deteriorating as saline water intrusion contaminates freshwater resources. Coastal areas are especially vulnerable to the rising sea levels, which exacerbates the problem of saltwater intrusion into freshwater aquifers. The 2014 report by the Intergovernmental Panel on Climate Change highlights the extreme precipitation changes experienced in eastern Africa, including Eritrea. Droughts and heavy rainfall have become more frequent over the past 30 to 60 years, leading to a significant impact on Eritrea's agriculture and food security. <laughs> The impacts of climate change are not uniform across Eritrea's different regions. Changes in rainfall amount, intensity, and season length, rising air temperature, and declining surface water flow have all had an impact on Eritrea's water resources, particularly in the central highlands of the country. The average annual temperature has increased by 1.7 degrees Celsius since 1960, and sea levels have risen by 0.02 meters per decade between 1992 and 2010 in the Red Sea. As a result of the decline in surface water flow, groundwater recharge has also declined, leading to a reduction in the groundwater levels and quality. This situation is particularly worrying because groundwater is the primary source of water for many communities in Eritrea, particularly during times of drought. <laughs> The challenges posed by climate change in Eritrea require urgent action to mitigate and adapt to its impact on water resources. This includes the implementation of sustainable water resource management practices resilient towards climate change, such as the construction of solar-powered water supply systems and the construction of soil and water conservation mechanisms, like check dams and terracing, to enhance the groundwater resource capacity. With these efforts, Eritrea can ensure the long-term sustainability of its water resources and build a more climate-resilient future for its people. <laughs>